Welcome to your wonderful Wednesday Shave of the Day. Hey, Eric here with Adventures in Wet Shaving, and welcome back. It's good to see you. My one word is heart, and I put my heart into everything I do. We're helping 10,000 straight razor shavers, so if you're interested in learning how to straight razor shave, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Then click on the bell next to it to be notified when I upload videos, that way you won't miss a thing. I do Shave of the Day videos on Wednesdays and Sundays, so stop on by and check them out. Tonight, we are using my Fine Edge Ostiso. Yes, we are. This is out of the early 1920s. Beautiful razor, extra hollow ground. And it is nice, it really is. It's like new old stock. And I thought, why not pair that up with Fine Snake Bite? So I got a Fine Edge Ostiso and a Fine Snake Bite. And this is basically just soap and menthol. Oh yeah, I like it. Now, I have had that soap blooming. We're gonna go ahead and pour that off and put that on as a pre-shave. Yep. So let's get that on. Oh yeah. Yeah, just work that in. Very nice. Okay. And now for our brush tonight. I am using my synthetic that I made. And this one has got a quarter in the bottom of it, a Connecticut quarter. Now, it hadn't been soaking because all you have to do with these is get them wet. So I'm going to get that wet get most of the water out of it and we're going to load that brush up yeah all right so hopefully you are well we made it to the midweek shave oh yeah hump day mm -hmm. that is good yes it is and uh, you know the uh, weekend right around the corner mm -hmm. yeah looking forward to that Hoping for some good weather. I don't know if we're going to have good weather or not, though. But it's okay. All right. And this, this is getting nice already. Nice and pasty. Okay. And I'm making a huge mess. But it's all right. So hopefully your work is doing good. And, uh, you know, everything's going your way. And you're in high spirits. Are you in high spirits? I hope so. Yeah, that would be good. All right, I think we're pretty much there with this soap. So let me go ahead and I'm gonna just kind of clean off that bowl and get some of that out of there. All right, and look at this. <laughs> nice. Yeah, that's when you know you got a good lather, right? When you make a mess. Oh yeah. There we go. Nice. Now, gonna get those hands cleaned off and hopefully get them cleaned off. Wow, that's a lot of soap. All right, now, here we go. Look at this. Nice. Oh, yeah. So let's go ahead and get that going. Now, I do Straight Razor Edge Friday specials on the first and third Friday of every month. So hopefully uh, you have been able to enjoy some of those. Yeah. So now... Uh, you could click on this card right up here to see different strokes for different folks. So these are the different strokes that I use for honing. And you can check that out. See what's going on. Yep. Now, I do these Straight Razor Edge Friday specials to answer questions and comments from you. So, go ahead and put a question 
put a comment, put a suggestion, or an idea for a Straight Razor Edge Friday special down in the comments of this video, and we will do the best we can to get that going for you. Yep. Oh yeah. Wow, and this soap is coming to life. I'm gonna have to put a little bit of water on it. It just needs a little bit more water. This is a really fabulous brush though. There you go, look at that. Oh yeah. There we go. And I can feel that menthol kicking in a little bit this time. Next pass is even going to be better. Oh yeah. So now this is pass one and that's going to pretty much be with the grain for me. Let's do this. Nice. That feels good. Nice. Yeah, feeling good. And the longer that soap stays on, the more menthol I'm getting. That's nice. There we go. Oh yeah. Looking good. Yeah, hopefully you're having some good chase. Let me know. That would be fantastic.
yeah, nice. Yep. There we go. There we go, pass one complete. Yep. I think we're doing good. Let's go ahead and get that cleaned off. Oh yeah, nice. Yeah, that's good. That's a nice razor, really is. Now you do have to be a bit more mindful with these extra hollows because uh, they can really kind of bite you from time to time but it can be done it really can you can shave with it and have a good shave so you know just go ahead and go for it if that's what you're interested in uh, if you're new i would suggest a full hollow or maybe even a quarter hollow i really have good time with them yeah they really work well for me and they're comfortable and more forgiving as well. So, you know, you could always check that out, see what you think. Oh yeah, nice, nice. This is a really good brush. And that soap is all nice and pasty again, just the way I like it. Put a little water on that. We'll get that just the right place. And this, this brush does have some pretty good backbone as well, which is nice, really is. And that brush is really a lather machine. It is, it's so good. It just keeps giving. All right, now this is pass two, which is going to be against the grain on my cheeks like this. In here, it's gonna be against and across, and then this will be against the grain. So let's do this.
All right. Yeah, now, I'm gonna switch hands and get this other side. Nice. Yeah, really good, really good. They got a couple little bumps there, but nothing bad. No big deal. Oh yeah, nice. They got a little close there, too. <laughs> oh, I'm telling you. It does happen from time to time. No big deal. There you go. Pass two complete. Now, let's get that cleaned off. See how we did. I think it's going to be good. Dare I say fine? Maybe it's going to be fine. <laughs> yep. I got fine squared here. Got fine edge osti so. And fine snake bite. Hmm, that's it.
Very nice. And those cheeks feel good. They do. Yeah, without a doubt. They are right where they need to be. Now, let's go ahead and do the half pass. Now, the half pass is going to be against the grain on my jawline and my neck. And this is how I found that uh, works the best for me. So you go ahead and click on this card to see the half pass reveal and see if that may be something that will help you. And even if it's not exactly the same thing, do it modified, modify it. Modify it and make it yours, right? That's what it's about. Oh yeah, man, this soap is marvelous. Look at that. Still nice and creamy. Oh, and there's still a ton of soap left in that brush. There really is. It's so good. Yeah, okay. Stop there. I can just, I can play with that all night. But we're not going to. Nope. All right. Here we go. Half pass. Let me clean that off. Just for, for the tiniest little bit. Oh yeah, nice. Yeah, definitely a fine shave. Here we go. Nice. Yeah, I hit a little spot right there. No big deal though. It happens. And it'll be fine. It really will. Here we go. Another shave in the books. Yep. It felt good. Nice menthol shave too. I like that. I really do. Now let's get that cleaned off and see how we did. Oh wow. Oh that's a good one. <laughs> yes it is. That is a good one. 
Nice. Okay, now alum everywhere. And I just dry that off. Yeah, now that is wonderful because it's antiseptic and astringent as well. Now, for my kind of aftershavey thing, we are using Thayer's, and this is the Extra Cool. Yes, it is. So this is gonna be a kind of grapefruity, but got some menthol as well. Yes, it does. Oh, nice. Nice, and that's good. That's good stuff. Really is. Now, for a kind of cologne thing, even though it's pretty much just menthol and alcohol, all right? Check out that label. Isn't that just the funniest thing? This is so good. I really enjoy it. So, I'm gonna get a little bit of that. Put that on as well. Oh yeah. Oh, there's some menthol there. Nice, nice. And, of course, we're going to top the shave off with Nivea Poche Balm. Put a little bit of that on right there. A little dab will do you. Oh, yeah, nice. All right. You click right up here to see the best how-to beginner shave you've ever seen. Click right over here to see my latest video. Click down here on the video especially picked out for you. Click over here on me, subscribe, like, comment, share this video with your friends. Have a great shave and a good day. And I will see you next time on Adventures in Wet Shaving.